Hello everybody, welcome to our channel. I'm Mark and in this video I'm going to show you what's the best way to grow an avocado from seed. I would imagine a lot of people searching on YouTube are going to be searching how to grow an avocado from seed and asking the question, what's the best way to grow the avocado from seed? Well in this video I'm going to show you two methods of growing an avocado from seed. The more popular version, which is on YouTube, is where you have the glass and the cocktail sticks and I'm going to show you a second version going back to nature and we will see which one produces the best results and what I think in my opinion is the way to go. But firstly you need to start off with an avocado. Now I've just bought this today um, in French it's known as an avocado on point which means it's ready to eat. Rather than being very hard this is quite soft and that's the best type to use when growing an avocado from seed. Uh, get one that's quite soft guys. Um, I'm going to pass you over to Naomi and she's going to demonstrate how to remove the seed from the avocado and stick around to the end and you'll see how we enjoy eating avocado either as a dessert or just as a healthy snack. It's very popular on YouTube now but I remember doing this back in 1985 when working in the, the city. All the guys in the offices were growing their avocados from seed and it was just an office thing and once the plants had started we'd take them home and uh, grow them at home. So in this video I'm going to show you all the stages of growing an avocado from seed. Okay guys I'll pass you over to Naomi she's going to show you how to extract the seed from the avocado. Simple as that. Okay guys, it's very easy to grow an avocado from seed. You just need an avocado seed, some toothpicks, and a cup or jar to contain the water. It's as simple as that. Now, once you've uh, cleaned your avocado seed, um, make sure you know where the top and bottom is. That's actually the top, which was attached to the tree, and the bottom just here. And when you plant this, you have to make sure that the top's at the top and obviously the bottom's at the bottom. Now the first thing to do, as I've said, we've cleaned the avocado seed. We just need to peel away the brown membrane first. And you can use your nails for this. And it's basically like peeling an orange. So we just peel away the brown skin. As you can see, it comes off pretty easy. Okay guys, the skin's been removed from the avocado seed, so we're ready for the next stage. Um, you'll notice there's a few lines, and these will be the cracks that appear when you plant the avocado seed. So when we place the um, cocktail sticks, make sure you don't place them in the cracks, okay? So take your cocktail stick and you want to do it about two thirds of the way up. So that's the top that was attached to the tree, that's the bottom. And place the cocktail stick at an angle into the seed. And we need three of these. So again, avoiding the crack there. Place another one in. and then the final. Okay, so that's the avocado seed prepared. And the reason we've done it in an angle is so that when you place it in a jar of water, the top of the avocado seed will remain out of the water, while the bottom is under water. And that's what's gonna start the process off. So let's just fill this up with water, and I'll show you that part. Okay guys, just filled the jar up with water. And as you can see, the top remains above the water level, while two thirds of the avocado is below. So I'm gonna place this on a nice sunny windowsill, and I'll come back in a week's time to let you see how it's progressing. 
and that's how easy it is to grow an avocado from seed. Okay guys, on with the second method of how to grow a avocado from seed and what's the best way to grow an avocado from seed. Um, before I show you this second method, let's think about what happens in nature. There's basically a cycle of life with the avocado. The avocado comes from an avocado tree. That tree grows, produces flowers, those flowers then go on to produce the fruit. Some fruit is picked for human consumption, others may be missed, fall to the floor, the fruit rots, and the stone, or seed, will germinate and produce a new avocado tree. And that's the cycle of nature. Now in nature, there isn't a glass filled with water and three cocktail sticks. So what I'm gonna do is just follow nature. I've already got a pot prepared, um, just with um, potting compost. And literally, I'm gonna place the avocado seed in the potting compost and cover it so that only a third of the stone or seed is above soil level. Now, I can understand why the glass way is so popular. It looks cool. You know, you get to see the roots growing and uh, then the stem comes up. And I think it's just a cool sort of thing to do. What you don't see with those videos though, is no one shows you repotting the avocado tree from the glass to a pot. Is that because there's so much stress involved with the plant and the plant dies? I don't know because you don't get to see it. But here I'm copying nature. It's not going to be so cool because we're not going to see the root system growing, but it'd be interesting to see whether the avocado tree starts growing from the top at the same time as the one in the glass. And the good news is this is already in a pot. It doesn't have to be repotted. There's no stress involved. Um, and once it does outgrow this pot, the root system's gonna be so strong, the plant's gonna be so strong, that it's just gonna be easy to repot to a larger pot. I'm gonna place this in the same window sill as the avocado seed that's growing in the glass, and we'll see a direct comparison to which method of growing an avocado from seed works best. Okay guys, a little update on growing avocados from seed. Two weeks in, and this is the avocado grown in the water, in the jar. And as you can see, it's split. However, there's no split at the bottom yet, and there's no roots coming through. But, as you can see, things are happening. And if we move across, the same has happened with the avocado seed in the soil. Split at the top, obviously I can't see what's happening below. But, as you can see, it's at the same stage as the avocado seed in the water. So both avocado seeds are germinating at the same rate. Okay guys, short update on growing avocados from seed. Here's the avocado growing in the water with cocktail sticks. And if we just lift this up, you can see we have a root forming. So we're about five weeks in guys, and if we move over to the avocado growing in the soil, obviously we can't see what's going on below the soil, so it's just a case of waiting to see which avocado starts sprouting above ground first. But there we are, short update on growing avocados from seed. Hi everybody, welcome back to how to grow an avocado from seed, and what's the best method of growing an avocado from seed. And as you can see, we have an upright stem coming from above, the avocado grown in water with the cocktail stick method. And it's got a nice root system. One thing I didn't mention when I started this video was just to make it fair, we actually started growing four avocado seeds, two with each method, just to make it fairer. So the first one to grow a shoot was the avocado growing in water with the cocktail sticks. The other two in the soil split after the one that you've just seen. We can't see obviously what's going on below ground and as yet there's no upright shoot coming up or on this one. This one looks like it's going to happen very soon though because the cracks got quite wide. And it may surprise you but the other avocado growing in water with the cocktail sticks is actually the last one to crack, to split. 
this only split last week. So it just goes to show they all develop at different times. So we'll see which one shoots next, be it the one in the soil or the one in the water. I'll keep you updated guys on which is the best method of growing an avocado. Okay guys, here's an update of the uh, how to grow an avocado from seed. And in fourth place currently is the avocado grown from cocktail sticks in a jug of water. It's split, but no signs of an upright shoot or any root system as yet. We then move over to third place and we have an avocado seed that's growing in soil and that started to shoot. In second place we have another avocado seed that's growing in a pot of soil. That's about 15 centimeters tall now. And in first place the avocado grown the avocado seed grown in water with the cocktail sticks. It's got a lovely root system. We don't know obviously what the root system's like within the uh, soil pots. And this one is about 40 centimeters tall. Hello guys, welcome back to what's the best way to grow an avocado seed. Whether it's best to grow an avocado seed using the cocktail stick method with a jug of water, or whether it's best to grow an avocado seed directly in the soil. Okay, I guess you could say, in first place, we have the avocado grown with a cocktail stick method in the jug of water. This was the first avocado to split. We couldn't tell obviously which was the first to um, do the roots, but this was the first plant to throw up a stem. And as you can see, it has a very extensive root system. So that's ready to plant now. In second place, we have the avocado seed grown directly in the soil. And in third place, another avocado seed grown directly in the soil. And it may surprise you, but in fourth place, we have another avocado grown with the cocktail sticks directly in water. And this, although split probably two or three weeks ago, has only just started to throw out its roots. So, What's the best way to grow an avocado from seed? I guess if you've got children, this one's the most exciting because you get to see the root system. However, just through practicality, my preference is to grow the avocado directly in the soil because I haven't got to repot it. Um, the one thing I will say, guys, every time I watered the avocados in the jars, I watered the avocados directly in soil as well. So this soil always remained damp, never dried out. I was topping this water up every other day or every day in some instances. So they got water at the same time. Hello everybody, welcome back. It's the 21st of April 2021. So 15 weeks from when you last saw the avocados growing. And this is all about what's the best method of growing avocados from seed. And I've got some news. We've had a failure. The second avocado that was growing in a jar sprouted roots and as you can see the roots are quite extensive now but nothing's come from the top no top shoot whatsoever so we've had a failure guys the other thing I'm going to do in this video is to show you repotting an avocado that was grown from seed because it's something you never see in other videos on YouTube um, showing how to grow avocados from seed. Guys, I'm gonna show you how to pot up an avocado that was grown from seed. This was the uh, winner of the competition that we did. And this is 15 weeks on from your last seen it. And as you can see, the root system is very extensive. And we're gonna pot it up now. Here we are guys with the uh, second uh, 
runner-up and this was the avocado seed that was grown in soil and as you can see it's actually looking really healthy and um, the leaves are a lot bigger than the one in the water um, we do have some browning of some leaves and we've had it on all our avocados um, and they just fall off and new ones come out so I'm not that concerned about it so as regards to repotting this avocado let's get started I've gone for a larger pot and the mix I've got is just common soil, topsoil, mixed with some potting compost and my magic ingredient, rabbit droppings. So fill it halfway up. I'm going to remove the cocktail sticks now. Don't need them. Oh, that one don't want to come out. And just measure that. That's about right. <coughs> and I'm just going to fill it back in. I'm just supporting it as I'm filling it up. Here we are, the avocado grown from seed, now potted up. I must admit, it looks a lot better in the pot now. Let's see how we do over the summer months. Just gonna give it a good water now. There we are guys, all potted up. Um, as with any uh, repotting, always give it a good water afterwards. Because we're coming up to uh, the end of April now, I'm gonna leave this out during the day so it gets full sunshine and um, with this avocado, I'm gonna take it in at night until any danger of frost is over. And from the end of May through the summer, I'm gonna leave it outside. And I'll catch up with you again at the end of the summer to compare this one with the other one in the soil to see which has done the better over the summer period. So there we are guys, that's the second stage, repotting an avocado grown from seed. Stay tuned because I'm going to flip forward to the end of the summer and you can see how it's performed. My avocado grown from seed. As you can see guys, I've uh, half exposed the uh, seed as in the other one that was grown directly in the soil and how it's been growing in the jar with the cocktail sticks. Half submerged under water and half in the dry air. So that's how I potted it. Growing avocados from seed. What a lower pleasure. Guys, we've just entered September and the avocados that have been grown from stones have been in the garden now since May uh, and they're doing really well. Uh, the one on the right was the avocado grown with a cocktail stick method in the jar and the one on the left was grown directly in the soil. They're both actually the same size, just that one's in a larger pot than the other, but they're absolutely spectacular plants you know they really add a sort of subtropical feel to the garden because they're amongst my bird of paradise and you know as you can see at the bottom you've got these broad green long leaves and at the top of the plant you know you've got these sort of burnt orange leaves coming out and uh, they really add something special to the garden so growing avocados from seed is a great way to get new plants for your garden and your home, because obviously these will come in just before the first sign of frost. So I'll probably leave them out until sort of mid-October, keep an eye on the weather and just bring them indoors uh, and bring them out again next May. But yep, absolutely love them. And uh, I'll put them into bigger pots next year. But as you can see, from start to finish, from growing avocados from seed all the way through for a year, this is what they end up looking like. Spectacular plants for anyone's garden.
once the avocado flesh has been removed from the uh, skin, it's now a case of just mashing it with the back of a fork. Mash it until all the lumps are gone, guys, and you've got a nice smooth consistency. I mentioned all the guys in the offices were growing avocados back in uh, 85. That's because we we're all having bacon and avocado sandwiches. And the sandwich shop would give us their uh, avocado seeds to grow. Okay, once it's all mashed, add a little bit of uh, honey. Mix together. And now it's ready to enjoy.